Hey guys, before we get started, I do like to say thank you for watching this and supporting me. I do also would like to mention before we go on with part one, later on in this episode, like with 10 15 minutes left of the video, that I did something that just caused the entire video. To listen to synchronization. And I do like to apologize for the length of this video. I was into, so into, uh, doing the uh, tutorials, and I didn't even look at the time. <laughs> so, I was hoping for that to be a 30 minute recording, but nope. It ended up being a 45 minute recording and on the background the uh, moving background I'm sorry about the random flashes every now and then I did not do the extra step that will ensure I had launched it into a AVR file so I can import it into my video here so with all that said let's um Go ahead and watch Mega Man Software's part one. Thank you all. <clears throat> hey everybody. Twilight Link Boy here with a another LP project. And I'm actually quite happy to do this one too. Because this one was a fan requested game. Well, I had some control, but of like... On the picking, because I want to do Star Force, Mega Man Star Force, but I didn't know which one. So I'll let you guys decide it for me. So, the winning game is. Mega Man Star Force Pegasus! Yahoo! I'm actually kind of excited too because um, this uh, because each each game Leo software Leo Dragon Pegasus um, all have different uh, they have some differences in them and I'm gonna be putting them out as I go along. So let's go ahead and do a new game, because that's like the only option there. Two twenty X this time. Wow. So here we are. Way ahead in the future. ET life has been discovered. Oh boy. New Space Exploration Agency NASA and in an effort to enter into a friendly relationship or border band with the aliens, launched a space station named Peace. Awesome. This is a space station. Man's dream to find other intelligent life among the stars has finally been realized. However, the space station, the hope of man, met with a mysterious accident, and it disappeared to whereabouts unknown. So there it is. Off into a mysterious land. Of course, many people worked hard to find it, but the space station could not be found. And then, a few months after the incident, Incidents, a section of peace was found in the sea. All hope was lost after that. NASA took a hard and stopped the search and put the project on hold permanently. Oh, three years the day have three years to the day have passed since.
I can't believe it. it's only been three years since Kevin's space station vanished. Hmm, I suppose it has. Oh, I want to ask you about how he's doing. He's in fifth grade now, right? He would be, but he still can't be able to go. Ever since that incident, he, he's been very close to, towards everyone. Close. <laughs> I don't blame him. The boy lost his father, who he loved dearly. That's got to be tough. But if he's not going, what about his studies? We're managing, we're managing with the college force system. He's studying from one of the textbook type cards, Navi, teacher man. But he's not really focusing. He fills with gadgets or reads about the stars. He wants to move out to outer space to find his dad. Oh, I see. If only we had more power, we could have found Aaron. It's okay. It's not your fault. It was an accident. Come here and say hello, young man. Fine. This this man is Mr. Boyer. He worked under your dad at NASA. Howdy. Hey. I really owe him one from when I w worked at NASA. That was one brave man, your father. Oh yeah. I quit NASA a while back, and now I'll work at my own lab just outside of town, researching the Earth, space, and the stars. If you want, you're welcome to drop by. Um, don't be rude. Introduce yourself. Uh, um, okay. Ah. And what's the neat thing about um, the last name slot in this game only? Um, that if you change it from Stella to, let's say, Hakari, for example, like Lan Hakari from Mega Man Battle Network, your mom's last name would change too. Instead of it being Hope Stella, it would be Hope Hakari. And, yeah, that was kind of a bit of a jump that I just did there, um, in the game. Because later on, you are able to, and it's like the only thing I want to say, you are able to jump from, or like going to other people's, uh, tr transfers and check, check them out for that. So, um, knowing me... I would like to keep it, um, I would like to keep it simple. The silly old kiss rule. Keep it simple, stupid. <coughs> and I just like sticking with the storyline. Or, or joke character's name. My name is Geo Stella. Nice to meet you, Geo Stella. Oh, be before I forget. I bought you a present. This is a very special pair of glasses. It's called a visualizer. I heard your father used to use it in his work, but I don't know. I don't know much else beyond that. I found it when I quit NASA, and I just thought I'd give it to you. How nice! Gia got the visualizer. This was. Dads. Thanks. Are you heading to your usual spot? Yeah, it's going to be clear out tonight, so I'll be able to see the stars really well. Geo, your transit is on. Oh. Geo, uh, don't need to do those kind of stuff. And there we go. 
Honestly, why must I always remind you to keep your chance on? Now, now check your brother cards. You brothers, who cares? I don't have any brothers, so no one is going to see my personal page anyway. What are you talking about? If your chance is on, no one can see your ID info either. Okay, I get it. I'm going now, Mom. Be back in a bit. Man, the beginning of these games, oh my gosh, always takes so long. And then things just happen like really quick after the day of the beginning. It's always like that. I wish you could develop a few bad relationships with some friends. Yeah, me too. By the way, what's your, you're heading off to? Vista Point, just behind the school. He goes there every day around dusk and just stares up at the, the sky. He thinks he'll see his dad. <laughs> Ever since that day, time has come to a stop for us anyway. I know we should move on, but it's so hard to. Looks like I got some mail. Let me see. I can check my mail by pressing the X button to open up the menu screen. And then pick an email. So, with that said, this is our um, end game menu. You can check your battle cards, check your items, which I don't think... Uh, yeah, we don't have any, but these are the items that we can get. And we can go up to a maximum of 99, which is... Which is awesome. Anyway, battle network four. So, uh, let's see. Small energy. Boot. Small energy boost restores 50 HP. Restores four health for the deluxe energy. That's for the energy. Means. Okay, okay, okay. Got. Uh, cloaker. Right. You'll buy invincible for a while. That means you won't be. Now, I'll explain it in a little bit. Uh, large energy restores 200 HP, and I have that auto unlocks purple wave mystery there. We'll get into that a little bit. <laughs> Increased chance of meeting the previous enemy. Your library, which um, <clears throat> bad cards will only show itself if you have it. Have at least seen the card or have it in your library at least once. So just get a copy, for example, I got one one heat ball, which I'm pretty sure I have more than heat ball. More than one heat balls. Um let's just go with one for now. If I have that one and I sell it or trade it for something else, um the heat ball will still be in my library. You have to see the card to get it into your library. That's how it works. And save! Save game! Let's go ahead and save the game. Save complete. Wow, I'm not used to single tapping. Like that, because... And uh, save valley, you know. Has not been made. And it's interesting. And uh, these two can't use those yet. Here's your library. Um, e email, excuse me. We already did library. And class review echo elementary. This week we studied about transfers. Transfers are the mobile terminals. Everyone wears on their arms. They have a variety of, of functions such as email and phone. They also store your personal page and other info. By pushing select you can switch between the different screens of your transfer to display such things as your personal card, brother card, and navi cards. If your transfer is displaying a navi card it means that 
navy is currently in your transfer. If you swipe a navy card through your transfer, you will activate an incredible power. Navies are your indispensable friends, so talk to them once in a while with the air button. Lastly, all chances are registered to one of three satellites up in outer space. Pegasus, Leo, or Dragon. Thanks to these satellites, chances on the same satellite can communicate with each other. Also, the very symbol of our age, of a modern age, the weather band is made possible thanks to them. So, speaking of the satellites, Pegasus is the sal is was the satellite of choice that you guys chose for me. So, uh, that means like I can like communicate with anyone that has the satellite. I mean the satellite. That's any one of the three games. But the Pegasus satellite game. So, but I. I still can send email to other people too, but uh, I think I'll talk about like more in-game stuff, but I could be wrong about that. So Pegasus, let's see what else. Um, everything's blue. Um, I'll be throwing up a pic uh, two pictures right now. That it, and these two are from the Dragon and Leo game. Dragon's green and Leo's red, as you can see. And your transfer in the upper left corner is blue. So, and same as before, green and red for Dragon and Leo. So, let's see, let's go to the battle card. So we got the Geo folder and the Extra folder. The Extra folder is unedible, but you can equip it or change its name. Um, we got the Geo folder. You can edit that, equip it, or change names. Take a look at this for a sec. Uh, Canon, you can um, swap out a battle card by pushing A on one and pushing A or the other way here. <sighs> Card box. Um, let's uh, cancel out that, and also you can push A on one card that's already in the folder, and push A to swap it. But for now, let's go ahead and keep it as is, and let's continue on. So, Yep, so the secrets, um, I am not going to go, st I can't do anything with that, yeah. But, always in the top screen slashing is because this is my only screen that I have so far. Um, it's, I was pushing select and nothing's happening. So, let's just continue on the game and see what else happens. You there! Wait! You're the one, aren't you? The boy who never comes to school. I am Lulu Platts of Echo Elementary, Class 5A, which makes you, me your class president. The big guy behind me is Bud Bison, and the short one is Zach Temple. Hey, jerk! Don't just stand there, say something! The prize is waiting for all response. What do you want? Nothing! It, but it's my job as class president to see that all of my classmates attend school. Oh, what? I hate when things are not perfect, so having one person missing is unforgivable. Sorry, but I've got nothing to do with you. <laughs> so true. Hey! You can't 
say that to the press! How dare you! The press is telling you to go to school! Do not look down on us because you're a taller. But! That! That's enough! In any case, Gio, I expect to see you at school tomorrow. Gio Stella. Something tells me he won't be showing up. If only we had some way to open him up. Hmm. Today's brother band lesson was... Yes! That may come in handy. Come on, you two! Let's get going! Your class person, Lena Flats. I don't like your attitude, but I can forgive you if you come to school. We have some brother band homework today. I will attach a new version of the brother band program we use in class. So make sure you do your homework. Oh, and one more thing. Come to school! Now analyzing the personal page editor. Okay, looks like we're all set. Now we're going to use this program and do your homework. So pay close attention, okay? This is your... This is the brother screen on your transfer. It shows you info about your brothers. You can access this screen by selecting brother on the menu screen. Ah! You don't have a single brother! I can't explain anything like this. Alright, I'll tell you what. Just for now, I'll be your brother. You better be thankful. Here we go. Now you and I are brothers. Actually, do you need me to explain brother band to you? I do. Because I'm recording this for people who have not played this game. Uh, or, yeah, not played it or seen anything. Uh, well, I guess so. Um, well, there were people who had not seen it too. So, yeah. You do? I thought everyone knew about Brother Bands. Well, whatever. Brother Bands is a system that connects friends together through EM ways. Once you become brothers, you can send mail and trade data no matter where you are. You can also see each other's personal page. Huh? What's a personal page? Why? Your profile and battle cards are shown there. If you're going to have any brothers, you're going to need a personal page. I know. Let's make you one. You got all that so far? You got it all so far? I... Yep. Okay. Now I'm going to explain personal pages. This is a personal page. You can see this by selecting your brothers or your own icon for the brother screen. So, a personal page, just that. It's well. It's well. Info about a person is displayed. You can see it was info and vice versa. Now I'll explain things one at a time. In the upper left corner, a person's name, face icon, and level are shown. All of this has already been set, so let's go on. Don't... Lower part... Shows your battle data. Mm -hmm. You can't see because I'm anyway. Alright. I'll leave for a sec. Push the A button when you're done. Okay? So, let me, uh... Um, briefly go through this before I pop it back up. <coughs> Excuse me. We got your favorite battle cards. Earlier when I was in the battle cards section of the 
mini screen, I, uh, you might have saw a thing called Fave. Well, once you hit Y on that, your favorite will pop up in this, in one of these six boxes. You can have maximum six favorites. And you have to have all, all of them, uh, you have to have six favorites, which I don't know why they insist that. In my opinion, it's just annoying, okay? So, yeah, favorites. Uh, but there's a nice little, um, a nice little knack about them. Uh, you will select one bad card as your favorites. I am going to explain that later. We got your link ability, your HP plus 20 and your gauge plus 1. So, yeah, I'll explain that one later. And your B combo, um, that will be later too. Hey, my best, my best buddy who's watching this. Yeah, Dead 100T. I'm doing a LP versus with him. And I hope he's noticing that I'm not doing too much spoilers, or like, barely any. <laughs> so, let's go ahead and push the A button, and continue on. Did you take a good look? Well, even if you didn't, I'm back, so moving on. Favorite is where you, s is where the six cards you set as your favorites are displayed. Favorite ballot cards can be used by spoilers, so you should set only your strongest cards. So, bear that in mind. Let's see, best combo... I don't know... I, I, I don't know actually much about that. But we don't need it right now, anyway. Link abilities are powers you and your brother give to each other as a boost. So, when you become a brother, the link ability, your HP plus 20 and your sensor plus 1 will be given for example, Luna Platts, she she only has that those abilities on her now because we're brothers, quote unquote. Uh, so yeah. So are you okay up to this point? And I want to continue on. Say yes, and you can always you're always welcome to rewind the video. Lastly, let's look at the upper right corner. Do you see? M-A-S and S-E-C-R buttons. Mess stands for message for uh, and it's where you can leave a note for your brothers. You can write about what you did recently. Flag or whatever you like. You can edit it at any, any time. So for now, just hurry up and write, write a self intro. Well, I want to keep things um, in game, so I want to um, go ahead and speed up and do this. I'll see you guys at the cut. Well, actually, I want to explain how to um, do do editing. Um, let's see, X is the shortcut for capitalization, so you can just talk in caps all you want. Uh, B is to delete, and Y is to Switch between each of those switch to those characters. Um like when you're uh, speaking Spanish or a different language that need that uses those characters. Uh anyways, let's go on um and say Um Yeah, L L trigger and Y trigger. So L trigger is to go back and you can just um, override that character, um, and, uh, you, and if you made a mistake and you really need a space, you go up here and do that, or it's just, what, what, what um, not, why did I say trigger? Ah, I'm using the Xbox controller for, under the simulator. L button and R button, so L button is to do what I just did, Y button is just to advance forward. 
So, be careful. And you can always go back and, like when I did it, and click delete. So, for example, I did this. I, um, let's see. Space. I'll go back and set it and hit. Hit the A button there. I can go left trigger. B. White trigger. Oh, God. I just closed the the, the end. What? Okay. Let's, Alright guys, I'm just going to cut it here. Okay! Boy, oh, I need to take a nap here. So, here we go. Hi, my name is Chiyosa. I like the other space. This is all just simple enough, isn't it? Next is secrets. Secret is where... You write your secret message. Secrets you can't tell to a stranger at all, whatsoever. No, no, no. You can tell, but you can tell it to your words. When you become buyers with someone, they can see your secret. So be honest. You can change your secret at any time. So for now, it's just right to the. Why do I keep hitting Y? Okay, congratulations on creating your personal page. If you have a brother, you'll always be connected, no matter where or when. It's neat. <coughs> so, hurry up, make some brothers. Oh, and more, one more thing. If you have a real friend and you want to form a brother band with them, you, you can only become real brothers with three people at first. But, if one day you achieve something great, the number of brothers you can have will grow. Real brothers can change their info day by day, so it's good to try to uh, <laughs> Ah, oh, hold on. Okay, I'm back. Mini screens on your section, okay? If both of you are on there at the same time, something even better will happen out here. Hmm, and that concludes your brother band homework. Now all you have to do is, is make some brothers. Go on there, trade data, and come to school. Oh, and one last thing. Come to school! Got it? I'll see you at school then. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah. Ah, I punched my mic. Looks like I got some mail. Uh, so here we are, the two question mark screens that we were allowed earlier are right there. Oh, jeez. On air and connect. Uh, you have to save before you enter this menu. Do you want to save? Yes. Save complete. Oh, this is where you can do uh, battles. That's right. Trade and battle with people nearby as a host, or you can be as a client. You guys gotta talk about who's hosting and who's being the client. I don't know that. And there are two different numbers to find specific people. This is if you are in a like hosting a, lo a large, large group of people and um. You assign them two, two digit numbers so that so that way um, your game can fil filter out on who to look for because you if you're like the host actually no I mean if you're the client you will see um, a bunch of hosts showing up so it's nice that they added that two digit number. 
so that you are able to do it only with your friends that you really, really want to do it with, not just some random person that, uh, in the Mega Man party, whatever. So you just go here, choose this number, for example, 69. And if you either select host or a client, the your DS will show well, we'll be searching for somebody um, with that same exact number. Let's go with a, like my buddy Double Hunt T, who is doing the Mega Man Battle of Questers with me. Um, if you pick 69 and he hosts, um, I'll be a client, and the client side will be searching for the for someone who is hosting as number 69. So with that said, let's uh, go ahead and continue on and go straight to on air. And those two menu options you have to, have to, have to save. Every single time. Because you never know what what's going to happen. So on air, um, you can do things live at the same time and all that. But you won't be able to see each other. We, we tried to... Uh, another good buddy of mine and I tried experimenting with that. It didn't work for some reason. Um, like trying to find each other, but um, all the on the on the air functions that you get, like for in battles so, and something like that, uh, you will um, um, you, you will get uh, which I'm gonna sh I'm gonna um throw a, li a link later in the description after I get some brothers in, in game. Uh, actually, I don't know when I'm going to do that. I'm hoping to do it soon. Um, people doing brother band, uh, on it, brother band on, on air. So, if, again, you can do a number, um, if you're in a big group with like hundreds and hundreds of people, you can do, for example, 69, and you can do, um, do do it on your host, and on your host part of the game will search for a client who has number 69. So, Nintendo Wi-Fi scenes, and oh yeah, that's why right. you can do. You can go online with this game. That is cool. That is right. And uh, once once you're connected to on air. Um, you will remain connected until you click sign off. You will close the connection and you can go on and you remember and do just about anything you want to do. So you know, now with all that tutorial stuff out of the way, let's go ahead and go ahead and get on with the rest of the in in uh, beginning of the story here. The stars were just beginning to twinkle as Geo turned his eyes to the heavens. Dad, Casafria is so bright tonight. Oh, and today, this man named Mr. Boyer came to our house and he gave me your visualizer. He's got some smart. Some sort of special lens, and it feels like it has a special power. But what can I see with it? If I use it, will I see you? Who am I kidding? Dad, who are you? I miss you so much. Dad. What the? This, this is Dad's access signal. It's getting closer and closer. Ah! And yes, I don't do very good voice acting. Sorry, guys. 
so does this earth. What the? Uh, uh. Ah! Whoa, whoa, whoa. You can see me? That's funny. Humans are supposed to be able to see energy beings like me. Uh, are you a monster? Why? Why are there was in the sky? That's not the Milky Way. Hey, that's for sure. Am I Jimmy? It disappeared. <coughs> ah! It's back! Now I get it. You can see my Ian body with those glasses. But, but, but I didn't see a thing earlier. Huh. I must have activated some sort of hidden power of those glasses when I zapped them. What? Hey, didn't you want to tell you to not gawk? But I guess I can blame you, kid. Who are you? The name is Omega Sis. But humans get wrong, so just call me Omega. I'm from Planet FM, so... So I'm what you humans call an alien, I guess. But to me, you guys are the real aliens. <laughs> So true, vice versa. Normally you can see, normally you humans can't see my ear and body, which is made of electromagnetic waves. But somehow, I guess with those glasses, you can see the world. <coughs> slow! Okay, I'm back. That world you see in the sky is a part of the wave world. Oh, wave world. R O A D. You got all that, Geostella? Oh, oh, there's an alien on my name. I heard it from a human I met in space. That human? Could it be? Was it my dad? Dad, where is he right now? Whoa! They're here already? They're here. Who's here? The creeps who are after me. That's who, kid. What the? That train's not supposed to be able to move. Ian Valis is from Planet Ephraim. They're going to destroy the tower with that. <coughs> what? If they did that, it'd be a disaster. Plus, Mom's still at home. There's only one way to stop that train. Go into it and delete those Ian Valis. To lick those roses, but how? Like this. Ah! Now let's go, kid. You want to stop that train? You do what I say. Got it? You hear me? It's have those cards. Those card force things, right? Yeah. Take out one of your blank cards. Uh. Um. Okay. Okay, here we go. Ha! Wow! The card's glowing. What's he doing? <sighs> I'm powering up the card with my energy. Looks like we don't have much time. Next, we've got to find a way for. A way for? It's where a chunk of space has been warped into a whirlpool shape. I bet you can see there was those glasses. Space has been warped into a whirlpool?
Hey, I see what. You don't need to wear your visualizer for this next part, but start the card I made when you're at a wave wall. You do know how to swipe a card, right? Of course, I just push the L button. Yeah, and then you gotta yell. Ian wave change! Dear Stella! On the air! I got I gotta live into it. My bad. Uh okay. Oh and I should I tell you kid. Push the Y button to put it on your visualizers. That way you can see the wave world. Now put those glasses to good use. Let's move! And with that said, uh, we've taken up a lot of time here. Wow. Um, so we learned about the butter bands and a lot about the mini screen here on this prize. And then the next one, we are going to the wave world and what we call a wave change. So, in the next part, I always, I always sit down. We are going to wave change and get those viruses and much, much more. See you all later and have a wonderful day. Goodbye, my friends.